Well, it's not, um, in the last two years, previous years, it's not a familiar role for us, but it's a, uh, um, we're excited about it. Um, Lake Ridge Academy, I don't want to look past them. Um, they have two seniors that are, um, I think they average over 20 points a game. So certainly um, to choose us as favorites being young, that's uh, a compliment, but um, we have a lot of work to do before then. Last year's finish, I don't think we would finish strong, but this year I think we could um, finish very strong, especially with the challenging schedule that we have ahead of us, which the coaches greatly prepared for us. Okay, um, we had a lot of open gyms, we put a lot of work in, and I think that will help us with our schedule. Um, we all worked really hard, put up a lot of shots on the gun, so I think that will help us. I think we have a lot of young talent coming up. Um, we have a couple injuries right now, our seniors out with like a hip injury, so I think when we get her back, that'll be great. And we have a transfer, Kaylee Tyna, who will be able to join us like after 12 games, I think. So that'll help us out tremendously. Um, I, think, I think we just have a pretty solid lineup right now. Well, finish last year obviously was unique with me having my heart issues. I wasn't part of the program, and uh, I got to watch it from a, a cell phone. Uh, they finished strong, though. They won the district um, under the coach, uh, under uh, the Tulich coach, Saria. And uh, I was so proud of the way they finished strong. They beat Lutheran East in the districts. And then um, really played with Berlin for a half. It was a, we were up one with two minutes left in the half, and we lacked depth. And that's, I just saw us tire out this year. That's one of our main goals is we're working on just building the team from the top, I mean the bottom to the top, and making sure we have that depth.